classification of animals. Welcome to our exciting adventure into the world of animals. In this video, we're going to learn all about animal classification. Are you ready? Let's dive in. Various animals appear. Animals are amazing creatures that come in all shapes and sizes. Scientists have sorted them into different groups called Animal Classifications. These classifications help us understand and organize the vast variety of animals on our planet. Different group of animals. Let's start with Mammals Mammals are animals that have fur or hair and give birth to live young. They nurse their babies with milk. Can you think of some mammals? How about lions? Elephants? Kangaroos? And monkeys? Examples of mammals include cats, dogs, dolphins, lion, elephant, kangaroo, giraffe, and monkey, and many more. Animated visuals of mammals. Next, we have birds. Birds have feathers and beaks, and most of them can fly. They lay eggs, just like reptiles, but they are very special with their ability to soar through the sky. Can you imagine being able to fly like a bird? Examples of birds include Eagles, sparrows, penguins, and owls. Animated visuals of birds. Now let's talk about reptiles. Reptiles are animals that have dry scale skin and lay eggs. They are cold blooded which means their body temperature depends on the environment. Can you think of any reptiles? How about crocodiles and snakes? Examples of reptiles include turtles, snakes, lizards, and crocodiles. Moving on to fish. Fish are fascinating creatures that live in water. They have gills to breathe underwater. They have scales covering their bodies and fins, which help them swim. Have you ever seen a fish swimming gracefully in an aquarium? Examples of fish Goldfish Clownfish Sharks And Salmon Animated visuals of fish Next up, we have Amphibians Amphibians are animals that can live both on land and in water they begin their lives in water and later develop the ability to live on land. They have moist skin that helps them breathe and lay eggs in water. One famous amphibian is the frog. Have you ever seen a frog hopping around? Examples of amphibians Frogs Toads, salamanders, 
animated visuals of amphibians. Last but not least, we have insects. Insects are the most abundant group of animals on Earth. Insects have six legs and three main body parts, head, thorax, and abdomen, and many different shapes and sizes. They often have wings, from busy ants to beautiful butterflies. Insects can be found almost everywhere you look. Examples of insects Butterfly Ladybug Animated visuals of insects Marine animals Marine animals live in water bodies, such as oceans and seas. Examples of marine animals Dolphin Whale Octopus So, there you have it. Mammals, birds, reptiles, fish, amphibians, and insects, each with their unique characteristics and features. Understanding animal classification helps us appreciate the incredible diversity found in the animal kingdom. Closing visuals of all animal groups. We've reached the end of our fantastic journey through the world of animal classification. I hope you've had an amazing time exploring the different groups of animals. Remember, the animal kingdom is full of wonders waiting to be discovered. By understanding animal classification, we can appreciate the incredible diversity of creatures that share our planet. From the furry mammals to the soaring birds, scaly reptiles, to aquatic fish, hopping amphibians, to buzzing insects. Every group has its own fascinating characteristics. So, the next time you encounter an animal, take a moment to observe its features. Is it covered in fur or feathers? Does it have scales or smooth skin? These clues will help you identify its group and understand more about its habitat and behavior. Remember, learning about animals is not just exciting. It also helps us develop a deep respect and appreciation for the natural world. As caretakers of our planet, we have a responsibility to protect and preserve the habitats that these incredible creatures call home. Nature and Wildlife Conservation I hope this journey has sparked your curiosity to continue learning about animals, their classifications, whether you become a biologist, a nature enthusiast, or simply a passionate advocate for wildlife, you can make a difference in creating a better world for animals. Thank you for joining us on this incredible adventure. Remember to stay curious, keep exploring, and let your love for animals and nature guide you. Until next time, take care and keep discovering the wonders of the animal kingdom. And yes, don't forget to subscribe our channel for more exciting content.